Hello, and welcome to my video on how to fix the error, user profile service failed to log on. Let's jump straight in. If you've got another user account on the computer with administrator settings just boot your computer as normal, and log into that account, and ignore this next step. If you haven't got another account, you need to enable the hidden administrator account. You will need to boot into safe mode, by pressing F8 key on startup, if you're using Vista or Windows 7, or if you have Windows 8 or 10 keep your finger on the shift key and click restart. Once in safe mode you can log into your damaged account. When your account has loaded, click start button, type cmd, then right click command prompt and select run as administrator. In the command prompt type. Net user administrator space slash active colon yes hit enter and you should now see a message that says, the command completed successfully. Ok with that done, log off the account, and you should now see an administrator account as well. Log into that one. Now we are in an administrator's account press the windows logo, and the letter R on the keyboard together, to bring up the run command. Now type regedit and press ok. You will now see the registry editor. You now need to navigate to the following path in the left hand side. Once you are there you will see some folders with the names starting S1 to 5 followed by a long number. Click on each one in turn, then in the main window look at the profile image path and make sure you can see it's the account with the problem. You should see that you have two folders for your username, and one ends in dot back. You need to right click the folder that doesn't have dot back in it, select rename and add dot bar to the end of the name. Rename the folder with dot back in it by just deleting the dot back part of the name. Now go back to the other folder with dot bar at the end and rename dot back. If you only see one folder with a dot back at the end, rename and just remove the dot back part. Now close registry editor and restart your computer. Your account with the profile issue should now load ok? If you enabled the hidden administrator account, you now need to disable it. To do this click start, type cmd, right click on cmd, and run as administrator. Click yes. Now type net user administrator space slash active colon o. Then press enter. Close command prompt. Job done. Your computer will be up and running again with all your programs and files, just how they were before this issue arose. I hope you liked this video, and don't forget to subscribe. See you soon.